This dude has a 99 steel rating, bro. The footage doesn't go far back enough for me to prove it, but I've seen his player card. He's got a 99 steel. Obviously, you're gonna see from this game, bro, I get plucked left and right when I make mistakes. And in this video, we're gonna be talking about these mistakes and what to do to avoid them, how you can play and adjust your playstyle for you not to get plucked on every single possession. Cause this dude sacrificed a whole lot to be able to get his, his 99 steel bro so he deserves to get plucks on people that are not careful first play the game and one of the most important things you can do to avoid getting plucked is gonna be working out the triple threat bro if you can work this triple threat and be effective with your scoring you're obviously gonna avoid getting plucked because there's just no moment in time in which this dude has the opportunity to get a steal on me and that's what you're gonna be wanting to focus on when you're playing against these guys whether it's a rec matchup or in the park or even on the one-on-one -on -one. like this game triple threat is your best friend when you have a high steal opponent step it back on him once again bro there's literally no moment in time where he could have gotten the steal on me right there and if he decided to reach at let's say at this point that is just more space for me to get my step back and that's what you're gonna want to focus on that is one of the topics that we're gonna discuss in this video now you, as you can see i try to get too cute with it right there and he ends up getting the steal that is on me bro you do not want to stop your motion when you're playing against these guys that's where they operate that's where they get crazy with it when you stop moving it is most of the time a free steal for him snap his ankles real quick we should have shot it off out of that spin but it's no big deal we're gonna bring the ball out but this time make it an emphasis on protecting the ball keeping the ball away from this lock bro as you can see he even tries to hit us with a reach, but we spin on him. It's green. But no problem greening these the spins in takeover. And they protect the ball extremely well. Right there. Do you see how high this dude is playing, bro? He's making steals. His primary focus on the defensive side of the ball. And you can turn that against him. Look at Delaney. He just gives it to me for free. He's got extremely high defense, but his, pos his positioning is so poor because he's only trying to steal the ball from me that you even get free lanes to the basket. Now here I stop moving obviously this is another pluck I deserve to get plucked on this play is it frustrating bro of course it is I I was not happy when I got plucked playing this game and as you can see by my field goal percentage this is not a pretty game either bro he cancels my spin animation literally trying to steal the ball from me he gets it gets the dunk it is frustrating bro of course but when you know that this guy spent a whole lot of attribute points into steals he gave up a whole lot of offense too bro he's not gonna have your offensive capabilities on his build just because he decided to go for a 99 steal and 2k has to reward lockdowns somehow so i've got no problem with steals being so good when there are effective ways you can use to prevent getting plucked as i get plucked once again we play good defense on this guy though he doesn't have the best offensive bag but this second topic in this video is gonna be the post up post ups is gonna be your best friend when you're trying to protect the ball keeping it away from these locks the post ups are gonna allow you to really get the ball out of harm's way as we hit him with another triple threat spin we're making a focus as you can see once again at to stop our motion in front of him keeping the ball away from him and if you can master the triple threat like this this dude even reaches me in triple threat that shows you how badly he wants it if these dudes are playing too high like he is right now i'm gonna have a free lane to the basket bro he's just chasing the steal at this point he's just chasing me so he gives lanes left and right to the basket there's just no recovering from this on his part now we're gonna be working on up to triple threat once again hit him with the spin once again at no point in time could this dude have stolen the ball from us this is what you want to focus on when you play against these extremely high steel guys spin out the triple threat we're gonna get the fade for the win and that is a beautiful way to end this game i thought this gameplay was extremely revealing as to how to play to avoid getting plucked all game by these guys hopefully you guys put this in practice comment down below if you've got any other tips or tricks to avoid getting plucked all game this is gonna be it for me man hopefully you guys enjoyed this vid if you did make sure to drop a like sub if you're new and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace